thanks for clicking on this episode of Blade Runner Tool Sharpening's Before and After. Uh, gentleman, well, actually, was a chef here. One of the restaurants gave me this uh, little um, uh, sushi knife. Uh, asked me to clean it all up. You know how I love doing that, especially on those brass handle pins and that uh, wood handle. It's a nice old one. It's a Misono, and it's made with uh, Swedish steel. So it's got a nice, really nice dragon engraved in there. So we'll see with our we'll see you with our results when I return. Welcome back to this episode of Blade Runner Tool Sharpening's Before and After. That sushi knife I was showing you a little bit earlier, I finished that up. Boy, did that come out sweet. Look at that point on there. Really beautiful edge. Really nice edge came out on that. Of course, that uh, carbon polishes up really sweet. Emblem come out really nice. I knew it would. So did the handle. Those pins just pop right out of that puppy. Put some what I use orange oil on that wood, and it just brought out the luster and the color in that. This gentleman, this uh, chef, has got quite a few of them actually. Um, here's the uh, sort of the pair to that one. That's a pretty good sized ones here. This one here, he had me do uh, previous. He had a busted tip on it, so I fixed that. And uh, this time around, I simply sharpened it. Some nice, really custom wood handles there. He's, he's uh, that's a really nice knife. So is this one here. It's a brother to that one. A little bit smaller. Finish that one up too. Nice edge came out on that. A beautiful point. So, as it makes the world go around here, Blade Runner Tool Sharpening's before and after. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hey, watch us on Facebook and now our YouTube channel. And remember, with Blade Runner, there's never a dull moment.